Assalamu alaikum friends, today we're going to dive into the life of a truly remarkable man, Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. While we often hear about his role as a messenger of Allah, there's another aspect of his life that deserves our attention, his incredible qualities as a husband. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam had 11 wives, mashallah, with his first wife being Khadija bin Khuwailid, and his last being Maimuna bin al-Haris. Throughout his marriages, he consistently demonstrated exceptional qualities that make him an ideal role model for husbands everywhere. In this video, we'll learn 10 amazing qualities of Prophet Muhammad as a husband. Get ready to be inspired. First quality, helping wives with chores. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam was a cooperative husband at home. He used to serve himself in many household duties without depending on his wives. al Aswad reported, I asked Aisha, what did the Prophet, peace and blessings be upon him, do in his house? Isha said, The Prophet would do chores for his family, and he would go out when it was time for prayer. Sahih al-Bukhari. He served himself by sewing up his clothes, milking his ewe, and washing his clothes. Second quality, patience with wives. One of the most popular qualities known about Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam was patience. He was the best role model for patient husbands with wives at disagreement times. He was patient with his wife Aisha, may Allah be pleased with her, in multiple situations like patience with her when she broke a plate due to her jealousy of his other wife. Anas said, The Prophet was with one of his wives when another one sent a wooden bowl in which was some food. She struck the hand of the Prophet and the bowl fell and broke. The Prophet picked up the two pieces and put them together. He waited until she brought the wooden bowl that was in her house, then he gave the sound bowl to the messenger and left the broken bowl in the house of the one who had broken it. This situation demonstrated the messenger's understanding of his wife's jealousy as an instinct in women. He used to deal with these situations with quietness, wisdom, and kindness. Third quality, treating wives equally. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam as a husband applied equality among wives in treating as he was known for justice in all life aspects. He avoided preferring a wife to another. According to Aisha's narration, may Allah be pleased with her, the messenger of Allah used to go to wives' homes to see them daily. Moreover, when Prophet Muhammad was ill in his last days, he wanted to stay at Aisha's home. May Allah be pleased with her to get care, but he desired that their wives allow him first to stay. So he asked for permission from other wives, and they all accepted. Fourth quality, consulting wives. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam used to meet his companion's men to ask their opinions on the most crucial decisions. He also cared for his wives' opinions and used to discuss different matters with them. Fifth quality, caring about wives' feelings. Prophet Muhammad as a husband gave the best example of caring about his wives emotionally. He dealt with their emotions with respect and paid attention to their complaints and words. Moreover, he demonstrated his compassion for his wives by wiping their tears and relieving their griefs. Sixth quality, eating and drinking from one place. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam ate and drank from the same place their wives did. Aisha, may Allah be pleased with her, said, when I drink water from the pot while in menstruation period and give the pot to the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam, he drinks from the same place which touched my mouth. Moreover, during menstruation, I was eating a piece of meat and gave the same to the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam and he puts his mouth in the same place of mine. Subhanallah, isn't it amazing? Seventh quality, treating wisely at moments of anger. One day, Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam's beloved wife, Aisha, was feeling particularly upset. Instead of reacting with anger or frustration, the Prophet gently placed his hand on her shoulder. O oh Allah, he prayed, forgive her sins, ease her heart, and protect her from distress. On another occasion, when a disagreement arose between him and Aisha, the Prophet sought a wise mediator. He asked her if she would accept Abu Ubaidah bin al-Jarrah as a judge. Aisha, still feeling angry, declined, fearing that he would favor the Prophet. Then perhaps Omar, the Prophet suggested, but Aisha hesitated fearing Omar's strictness. Finally, she agreed to Abu Bakr, her own father, as the judge. This choice revealed the Prophet's trust in Aisha's judgment and his desire for a fair and impartial resolution. Eighth quality, abstaining from violence with wives. 
Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam was the most gentle and kind husband. He didn't beat or abuse any one of his wives, other women, or even a servant. Aisha radiyatala anha said, the Prophet had never beaten any woman, any servant, or anything with his hand other than fighting in the way of Allah Almighty. He does not take revenge from anyone who harmed him, except when breaching the orders of Allah Almighty, in which case he takes revenge. Ninth quality, declaring love. Prophet Muhammad declared his love to his wife Aisha radiyatala on how when one of his companions asked him about the person he loved most. Amr bin al-As, may Allah be pleased with him, asked the Prophet, O Prophet of Allah, who is the person you love the most? The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam replied, Aisha. Tenth, racing with his wife. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam loved to play with his wives, precisely Aisha, may Allah be pleased with her, like racing in the desert. She narrated that the Messenger of Allah raced her twice, the first time before she gained weight and she won, and the second time he won. These situations demonstrated his love and kindness to his wife. Furthermore, Prophet Muhammad was an ideal husband in the following actions. Leaning on his wife's lap, Aisha, while she was menstruating. Keeping his wife's dignity. Urging his companions to treat their wives kindly. Beautifying himself for his wives. In the life of Prophet Muhammad, we find an extraordinary example of a husband who truly valued and respected his wives. He was a tireless worker, assisting with household chores and treating them with unwavering patience and kindness. His gentle demeanor and fair treatment of his wives serve as a beacon of inspiration for husbands around the world. Let us strive to emulate the Prophet's example by treating our wives with love, respect, and understanding. By doing so, we can create harmonious homes and contribute to a more compassionate and just society. If you found this video informative and inspiring, please consider subscribing to my channel for more content on Islamic topics. Don't forget to like, share, and leave a comment below. Your support means the world to me.